Uh, speaking of events, we're going to talk about this at noon with you. We're joined by the Bismarck Henning Rossville Alvin FFA, and representing them today, Gunnar Schrofeck to my left, and then Graham Abbott, who is here to talk about something that they're really excited about and passionate about, events that are coming up this month and in February, starting with a farm toy show. So I want to start with Gunnar first, because Gunnar, you were just talking about how this has been an opportunity for you to get into leadership opportunities, but also to kind of be a part of a family and to kind of get an idea of what you're excited about in the future. Tell our viewers at home why this is so important to you in your life, FFA. Uh, it's important to me because I, I feel that it helps me decide what I want to do in the future, mm -hmm. and it gives me a role of leadership while I'm younger Sorry. and while I'm not an adult. I get to be a leader in my school and show people what there is to do and what you can find a passion for. That's right. You're getting to set an example early yes. on. So tell us specifically, what has FFA opened your eyes to? Is there something very specific that you're looking forward to getting a job and doing one day? Uh, mechanics, actually. Mm, okay. I've been really interested in doing mechanics, and I've gone to these FFA events, and I've gone to one where I've been able to tour a college for mechanics, and I just oh. thought that was really awesome. So you like cars? Uh, more diesel more mechanic. Diesel. Yep. Okay, so I think our farmers could possibly appreciate your services one day. Then. Yes, they can. A community to reach out to. So, Graham, let's turn to you. I know we've got events coming up, so just mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about the Farm Toy Show. You said there's an auction coming up, and all this money that we're going to raise is going right back to FFA. Right. So, on Sunday, we're having a toy farm show. Um, you know, you'll have people come in with their vendors and stuff, and then just later on, around 12, I'd say the toy tractor show starts pulling. You can pedal tractors and start pulling those. Okay. And then in February, we're having an auction on the 24th, I think it is. And from there, it will help us raise money so we can afford like new things for the FFA program, like a greenhouse, or want to start taking a tractor and building that so we can auction off that okay. and help that build off that for our fundings. Now, are you also an FFA member yourself? I am, yes. What role do you play in FFA? Um, right now, I'm just an FFA member. I mean, okay. I take all the ad classes. I come to the events that we have, like the showings and everything, the meetings. So if anybody at home is itching to be a part of this, just like Gunner is, how can they get involved? Um, I mean, for the state of Illinois, you can just be taking an ad class. You can get involved. And then in January, I think it is, right? When the election starts, you can one? try being a member, an officer member. Okay. Even if you're not, you're still more than welcome to participate in every event that we have. And Gunnar, just one last message. Why would you encourage a, a youth like yourself to get involved? Uh, you, can find, you can find your passion for things and your leadership role and just it'll inspire you to be more involved in life Gunner, in high school. We can't thank you enough for all that you're doing already in FFA mm -hmm. and Graham, you too. And we thank you for the time that you made as well. Yeah, thank you. All righty, we'll have more on this on our website. Stay tuned to WCIA.com always. We're also going to share